Today is the battle of Mikey and JJ Chips for survival. Each of them has a big pack of chips. There is a big pack in a jar behind my back right now. Mikey has this Lay's, a very large yellow pack with a taste of salt. JJ has this Pringles jar, which is filled with lots of very tasty chips. Each of them has now built their own separate store in which they will sell their goods. Let's see what they have in store now. They have prepared very well for the battle with each other. <laughs> I have Lay's chips on the counter, which I want to sell to everyone who comes here. There are a lot of chips in my store that are delicious, and everyone will want to try them. I will open their sale soon. <laughs> Mikey, there are chips in my store that are as good as yours and even tastier. I will try to attract as many buyers as possible and sell everything. Mikey, just look at how neatly they are laid out and look delicious. No, it's not going to happen because I'll sell a lot more chips than you. Let's watch. Now begins the battle of chip shops among Mikey and JJ. Oh, Mikey, I'm ready for sale now, and the chips are neatly laid out on my counter. It's time to start selling, but it seems the first customer is running to us. Hooray! The customer has now chosen my Lay's store. <sighs> Buy everything I have. I promise that my chips are the best. You will not find such quality anywhere in this village. Don't listen to him, because if you eat his chips, you will get a very bad stomach ache. Better buy Pringles from me. They are the most delicious. I know that everyone will like them. I am very glad that you chose my store and are now ready to buy chips from me. <laughs> I don't understand why a villager bought chips from you now. It's not fair. My chips are much better, and you got a lot of money you earned. Look at what's on my counter right now. Just taste them. They are crunchy, and everyone who has tried them before likes them. Is there something wrong with you? No. Uh -oh. oh, no. Mikey, what have you done now? To the villager after he ate your chips. It got very bad. Look at his face. He turned very green. It seems to be poisoning. Mikey, you're the worst salesman I've ever known. Your chips are really bad. Stop being so mad at me. Maybe he just choked himself. <laughs> we need to call an ambulance. I have a phone in my hands and they will definitely help him. I can't know that. My chips are good. If you want to say that they are bad, then they are not. <laughs> I can't believe it. But is there really an ambulance coming here right now? I am very surprised, but I hope that the villager will be helped. Hi, I came to pick up a villager who was poisoned by chips. Let's take a good look at him. Everything seems to be bad. I'm taking him with me. He needs to go to the hospital urgently. <laughs> I told you that your chips were gone. Just look at how a villager is being hurt right now because you're selling bad goods. That's it. I'm not going to discuss this with you anymore. <laughs> now, we need to start new sales because new customers will surely come in the near future. I will do my best to make sure that they buy chips only from me. In no case should you be allowed to sell and receive money. Hmm. Mikey, I advise you to look into the distance now because a creeper is running towards us now. We must definitely please him with our chips because if he doesn't like something, he will explode. Hi, I'm very glad, but I advise you to buy chips only from me because they are made from natural potatoes. <laughs> I see that you have given me money now and you can eat delicious Pringles chips. I will be very glad if you buy more from me and next time you will definitely come back. I love it when my clients are happy and now I see how Creeper went to Mikey. I wonder how this is going to end now. I am very glad that Creeper decided to buy chips from me after all. He will like them very much. Wait, what's going on now? The horror. A creeper exploded outside my store. Oh. I don't understand how this happened. Now most of it has shattered, and now I have to restore it all. Stop hitting me. Mikey, it's all your fault. If it wasn't for your bad chips, the creeper wouldn't have exploded. Because when he bought from me, he was very happy. I still can't believe you're really that bad at selling your food. I will not be distracted. <sighs> I have now restored my store, and now I can sell chips. I see a villager running towards me. Better come here. Don't go to the next store. I have the best Lay's in this village. I agree to try your Lay's chips now. Please give me a pack. I'll try to eat. I see that you just ate it and your head turned green. Mikey, I told you that your chips are harmful. Therefore, it is better not to buy them in any case, a villager. I will be very glad now if you have a lot of fun. Ho <laughs> ho! Eat Pringles. Don't stop. I can see how much he liked it because he gave me a lot of money. Mikey, 
Everyone who buys my chips is very happy. I'll never believe it! You're just lucky, and most likely the villagers come to you on purpose. It's impossible to explain. I am so glad that I have managed to earn a lot of money now. I'm putting them in my big trunk. So, wait, why are there so many customers here now? There's a whole queue at JJ's store. I do not understand how this is possible. I will try to disrupt purchases now. Mikey, you can't scare away my customers. There are so many of them now that the edge of the queue is not visible. <laughs> I am extremely glad that my store has become so popular and everyone wants to try the chips that I sell. Now, I'll have a lot more money and Mikey will get even more jealous. I will not disappoint you. I have the best chips only. Now I see JJ standing in front of me and he has a huge number of customers. I'm very angry right now because I've earned a lot of money and I'm just throwing it away. We need to take them for ourselves now and in no case give them away. I haven't earned a single bill yet. I think he's noticed me now. <laughs> give me my money. Otherwise, you will regret very much that you decided to compete with me. If I find out again that you came to my store, you will regret it very much. Okay, keep them for yourself. I still have a lot to do right now. I need to run to the village. Keep an eye on my shop. All right, I'll do it. Now this is my opportunity to take revenge on him. Oh! It seems that no one will interfere now, and I hope that my plan will work. I need to collect the remaining money that is scattered and then proceed with what I have in mind. I want to make a trap inside JJ's store. First of all, I have to take all the necessary tools that I have in the store. I will really need it. I definitely can't do anything without spikes and a shovel. Now you need to dig a huge hole from which it will be very difficult to get out. I hope that I will still be able to do it unnoticeably. The main thing is not to suspect anything. <laughs> I'm making a trap inside the JJ store. Nothing could be more fun. I want to scatter spikes everywhere as quickly as possible and see what happens next. So far, in no case should we stop. I have to keep working and finish as soon as possible because I have very little time left. JJ can come back here at any moment. I don't want him to notice my trap. Therefore, now it remains only to check everything. I closed it from above. Woohoo! I hope she doesn't arouse any suspicions. So, now the spikes at the bottom are completely placed and I'm covering the hole with fake grass that you can fall into. The main thing is not to step on it in any case, otherwise I will find myself at the bottom. I want to see JJ fall into a trap as soon as possible. It's time to run to your store and watch everything from the sidelines. I think it's going to be a lot of fun. I will be very glad if my plan works after all. Yep. Now I can only wait for him to come back. I'm sure he won't suspect anything and everything will go well. Super! I did what I wanted in the village and now I ran back to my store. Mikey turned away from me for something. He must have been staring at me. So, I'm going to go to the store now. Ugh. Horror, I fell into a hole. What's going on here anyway? I have to try to get out now in every possible way. I definitely can't stay here because I might get hurt. Because I suddenly fell down, I cut myself very badly and it made me angry. I think I can guess who did it. He will definitely answer for what he did to me. Ugh. I have to get back at Mikey now. If you thought I wouldn't find out, then you were wrong. I just wanted to make a trap so that you wouldn't attract any more customers. You can't imagine how sad it is for me that you have earned so much money, but unfortunately, I have nothing. Don't fight with me. I see that you are stronger than me. I'd better run to the village now. Stop touching me. I hope Mikey doesn't come back soon, because then he will have very serious problems. I want to do what I've wanted to do for so long as soon as possible. A trap for Mikey is the best idea to get back at him. I have a plan. I'm going to make a railroad with a trolley. Hmm. My idea right now is that Mikey will definitely want to ride the rails, but he won't suspect that it's actually all a trap. I want to bring this line to the cliff now so that Mikey falls there, but he won't just roll down. And I understand that perfectly well. He'll probably want to jump off the trolley when he sees the cliff. I also planned this. Now, I will definitely show you how I finish building the railway tracks, and at the very end, I need to install something interesting. <laughs> I hope Mikey takes a ride on it and then falls into the abyss. It's time to run to the store now and get up there in order not to attract attention and watch from the outside how Mikey will fall into my trap. I hope the plan worked and there won't be any problems. I'll pretend that I'm selling chips now. I'm done. 
Everything is prepared, and now all that remains is to enjoy what will happen next. I'm back to the big pack of Lay's. We need to keep a close eye on JJ right now. For sure he's up to something. <laughs> I don't want to take too many risks right now, so I'm going to carefully move towards the store. He's not even doing anything right now. Maybe he's not holding a grudge against me. Mikey, take a ride on the trolley. I can't believe my eyes. I've always dreamed about it. I love railways. I'm going to ride it as long as possible now. I'm enjoying it and I'm not going to stop. It's so cool. I never thought I'd have fun and have fun. I wonder where these paths end. Yep. Okay, I won't get distracted. I'll keep driving. I think everything will go well. Oh no, it's a chasm. I just exploded violently and fell down. I was in a lot of pain right now. Unfortunately, I am trapped and deep in this abyss. Please, someone save me. I don't want to stay here. It's a very scary place. Super! I still managed to catch Mikey, and he is now in the cliff. I wouldn't leave it all just like that. So it's your fault. As you want to get out of there, so get out. And now I'm going to run to your store, because when you see it, there will be a lot of surprises waiting for you. I am so glad that I was able to take revenge. Ho <laughs> ho! Now it's time to run as fast as possible and start implementing your plan. I have a very cool and funny idea of how to harm the Mikey store. So that no one comes up to him, I will definitely make obsidian pillars and put lasers between them. I think that no one will be able to buy chips from Mikey this way. I'm closing Mikey's store. Now, I will try not to get distracted because I have a lot of work to do. I have to do everything carefully and in no case make mistakes through these lasers. Oh, No one has to get through, so I have to put them all around Mikey's store. I can imagine how angry he will be, but I don't care anymore. So, now I have already installed the first lasers and connected them between the pillars. Nothing could be more fun than this. You need to remember that you cannot touch the laser in any case, otherwise you can get badly burned and hurt. <laughs> so I made poles the height of a Mikey shop so that no one could even jump over the lasers. We need to keep putting up a fence around Mikey's store. There should be a lot of lasers. I place them from the bottom up and for this, I will need to bounce a little. How much fun it will be to watch Mikey get very angry when he sees that it will be almost impossible to enter the store. Hmm. I keep going on, and in no case do I stop. I have very little time. I'm sure Mikey will come out of the abyss soon and want to come back. By this point, I should have finished everything. At the moment, I'm doing everything according to plan and trying not to get distracted. It only depends on my work how the joke on Mikey goes. <laughs> it will be impossible to get into Mikey's store. You will not be able to pass such a number of lasers. They will definitely burn if you touch them. Nothing could be more fun. There's not much left. I'm almost done. There are only two walls that I need to close, and that's it. I think that's it. The good thing is that I took the lasers from my store. I have a lot of traps there that Mikey doesn't even know about. But now, thanks to the fact that I was still able to trap him, and he is still in the abyss, I will be able to make a laser fence for his store. Even Mikey himself will not be able to enter and will be very upset. Oh. That's it. I'm slowly finishing with the installation of lasers because I definitely need to check everything. I hope that I have not made any mistakes and it will be impossible to enter this store. Now, Mikey will definitely not earn any money and will lose all profits. I can imagine how angry she will be when she finds out what happened in his absence. All that remains now is to remove unnecessary blocks that stand near the obsidian. Mikey will be back here soon. I have to catch him off guard. I hope I can do it. <laughs> I'm practically out of this abyss already. It was extremely difficult to do this, but with the help of a cobblestone, I climb up. In no case can I stay here anymore because anything can happen to my store. I have a very bad feeling about this. I don't understand what's going on there. Oh no, JJ surrounded my store with lasers. What a horror. I see now that it is impossible to get there. Now I will do my best to get through these lasers. <laughs> but it will not work because they burn very much. My store is completely surrounded right now and I can't even go inside. You can't forgive this in any case. I'm going to take revenge now. I haven't been so angry in a long time.
Mikey, I see you, and now I can say with confidence that I was able to take revenge. You have no idea how much fun this is. You can't even go into your store and sell chips. I was able to outwit you after all. I wonder what you're going to do next, because you definitely won't be able to catch up with me. <laughs> I will definitely find an opportunity to get to you. You won't believe it, but I'm very angry right now, and one day the moment will come when I'll catch you. Now I need to catch up with him in every possible way. I won't let JJ go. He must be punished. I've never seen Mikey so angry, so now I have to hide near a tree. I think I see him chasing me. I will try to tame his ardor with weapons and finally destroy the Lay's store. Now I will have no competitors and I will still be able to destroy this big pack. Ho <laughs> oh. Stop it! What are you doing? Everything is going to suffer because of you. I admit, you won this battle. Just please don't destroy the big pack of lace. I need it very much and I don't want to lose what's left. I suggest you stop fighting now and have fun together. I won the chip contest. That's how our incredible adventure ended.